Hello friends, this is Raj Sastri from Raj Option Trading. Today is February 6, 2022. I wanted to do a quick video and low on low price stocks with $5 to $50 with the great growth potential. So with that, we got a few stocks here. Look, we got Intel. Intel is beaten down. We got a new leader, Pat Gilsinger. He's going to do well. They're opening up new chip plants um, you know, in Ohio. I think this company is going to do well in the future. And then you got your Indian company, information technology company called Infosys. Stock is very low price with the great growth potential. And then you got medical devices play here, Boston Scientific, beaten down stock with a great potential. And we got United Micro, again a semiconductor testing play here. It's a great one. Stock is beaten down here. And then we got great biotech beaten down stock here. XL Axis, one of my favorite. And we got Pinterest beaten down. Stock is trying to go higher now. I think it's a good turnaround play. So with that, let's uh, jump in and get started. So we got few st stocks uh, with the price $5 to $50 and volume more than 1 million shares traded. So these are liquid stocks, low RSI tells you these stocks are beaten down. We got both positive gross margin as well as positive net margin. These companies are making money. These are not money losers, low debt. Um, so these companies did not take too much debt and solid financials Altman Z score greater than two. These companies are not going to go out, go into bankruptcy. And we got next year earnings per share as well as revenue projection greater than zero. That means analysts have projected these companies will do well in the future. So with that, let's jump in and get started. So as you can see here, we got uh, top of the list Intel. Intel is beaten down as you, as you can see here with the RSI very low, just 36. That tells you stock is beaten down. Anytime in last 14 days or so, if the stock is beaten down, you'll get a low RSI. Look for five years, they've done 50%, which is not too bad. More importantly, look at uh, what the growth projection, target price is 56, right now stock price is 48 and uh, earnings per share growth is 5.34 next year and revenue growth is also great here 2.8 altman z score is 3.3 tells you it's very solid financially and pietroski score 6 means uh, accounting and books are solid for this company so i would uh, you know go with this name here and buy this depressed stock and hold it for a long time and then i got emphasis it's an Indian IT information technology company. Look at the great number here. They got overall score 72. That's great. And look, in the past, they've done great. That tells you the past uh, sales growth and uh, net margin. Company is making money, 19% net margin. That's a great play here. And look at the future. Stock price currently is 22. And one year target is $28. That's a good uh, target here. More importantly, look at uh, earnings per share growth and revenue growth for next year. Very solid. I like it. Artman Z score is 13. That tells you this company has got a lot of money. No need to worry about bankruptcy. Company is solid. And Piotrowski score 7. That tells you it's very rock solid when, when it comes to books. Consistently over the years, their books are improving. And then we got a few more. I will not talk through everything, but um, my favorites are the ones where you see a great past uh, performance as well as a great future potential. Those are my favorites, like Infosys here. And we got ABB. Look, look at the future performance here. Analysts have rated highly. And also you can look at Boston Scientific, same story. Those are my favorites here. And you can look at little, little Indian company again here, Wipro, same story. Look, uh, it's got a nice uh, performance, 126% in last five years. More important, look at the future projection. They have great future projection as well as solid financials. And look, we got U UMC here. It's got a top rate here. Look, 96 uh, overall score here. And look at the future growth potential here, both earnings per share and next year revenue are great. Company's got a lot of money, nice Altman Z score. And Pietrowski F score is also great. Tells you accounts and books are solid, you know, consistently over the years. And then we got a few more. Look, names like Hormel as an example. Right now, analysts are projecting their uh, target price is lower than the current um, 
Target price is 47 here, which is slightly higher than the current price. It's not too much, but there is uh, some growth in the future also. It's one of those steady eddy names. Does not do great, but uh, keeps the keeps treading the water here. Look, um, you know, Piotrowski score, F, F score is 33. That means it's not that great. And then we've got a few more as you see here. Uh, we got AMC. It's a Chinese company, as you might be knowing. It's a part of EM brands. It's, it's got a great potential here. You could buy this depressed stock also. Look at the future potential here. Currently, stock price is 41. It's got a nice 12-month uh, 12 12 month target of 67 and great, great earnings per share as well as revenue growth. I would uh, go with that one also here. One of my favorite here is Pinterest, as many of you know. It's a great social media company. Stock is completely beaten down. Uh, it's, uh, it, has, it has great sales growth and gross margin. Company is making money, net margin positive, 14% net margin, as you can see here. And look at the future projection. It's, uh, it's a great future product projection. Currently, stock price is 27. And it's a projecting it's going to be 49 um, in 12 months. And look at the future revenue growth and EPS growth. Very solid. Nice Altman Z score. No need to worry about any financial issues here. And great Piotrowski F score tells you companies' books are consistently stable. And overall score is uh, 67, which is not, not bad. As you scan, scan through here, we've got a few more here. I like uh, you know, Pulte Homes here. It's a great home builder, as many of you know here. A look at the future projection here. Nice 29% earnings per share growth and 10% revenue growth. You should uh, go with that one also. Right now, stock price is 48. The target price is 66 in 12 months. That's a great one here. And then I got a few more here. I like uh, Borg Warners also. It's a consistent player. Very, very steady eddy stock here. Look, current stock price is 43. And the projection for next 12 months is 54. Not too bad. More importantly, look, they're improving their both earnings per share as well as revenue growth for next year. So future projection is very solid here. And then you got a few more. Um, I like this gold stock here, AU. You could uh, look at this one also. I think it also has a great uh, growth here, as well as uh, New York Times. Not bad. Stock has done well in the future, in the past. Uh, future also analysts are projecting nice growth as you go forward. Look, stock price is uh, 41. Um, 12 months target price is 52. That's not too bad, or bad at all. So with that, let's look at a few more names. All right, so we got continuation here. All these stocks, as you can see, are net margin positive. Companies are making money, so you don't need to worry about uh, that aspect here. These companies make money, not money losers. Let's let's uh, look at look at the look at few stocks here and go from there. Look, we got the uh, Skechers, which is one of my favorite here. It uh, it's doing very well. It's, it's into uh, shoes, as you might be knowing, and also apparels. Look, uh, it's got nice five-year uh, um, past uh, performance here. More importantly, future performance is solid, uh, both earnings per share growth as well as revenue growth in the future next year are all solid here. Stock price is 44 right now. Look, uh, next 12 months projection is 61 here. Target price is 61. That's very solid. Nice Altman Z score tells the company not going to go out of bankruptcy here. And we've got a few more great, great companies here. Focus on stocks that have done well in the past and might do well in the future. As an example, we got Excel Axis here. Excel Axis stock has not done well in the past, but look at the future projection. Analysts are projecting nice 66% earnings per share growth, 21% revenue growth. This is one of those classic plays, even though it's, it has not done well in the past. It's got nice projection in the, for the future. Stock price is $18 right now. Look at the projection, $30 in next Next 12 months that's a good one to buy perfect score of 100 it's got a lot of pipeline in, in its uh, uh, pipeline it's a good one to buy here and we've got a few more as you can see here we've got pan american silver many of you might be knowing the silver stock here um, that's not that great as you see here it's okay not super um, uh, that's Amcor, but Pan American Silver, as you see here, it's got nice projection for the future. Look, 46% here um, for revenue EPS growth and 22% revenue growth. You could uh, go with that one also. And we've got a few more here. We got Sonos, 
I also like uh, home builders here. Look, we got a couple of home builders here, all beaten down as you can see here. Nice future projection, both uh, TMHC here, Tyler, Mo uh, Tyler Mason. Uh, look, it's got $29 right now. Look at the projection, 41. So you could buy this uh, TMHC here as well as KB Homes is also a good one here. You could buy both of these names here. Nice uh, EPS growth as well as revenue growth. You could uh, go with those. Yeah, we've got so many names here. I like Sonos also here. Sonos, Sonos is also a good one here. And we've got a lot of home builders as you can see here. TPH is a good one here. Even Ollis, it's got uh, Ollis is also a good one. You could uh, buy this depressed stock at this time here. Look, future growth is uh, not not too great but it's okay nice revenue growth here 10 percent for next year and we got a few more names as you can see here i like uh, i like elf here as you might be knowing it's a, a smaller company compared to um compared to other bigger brands like uh, alta beauty and um, you know and even uh, other bigger names but stock price is uh, 28 here Future projection is 36 for next 12 months. Look at the revenue growth and EPS growth. Nice EPS growth and revenue growth for the future. I would uh, go with this one also. And we got a few more here. I also like uh, Wanda. It's a good one here. Stock is completely beaten down. Look at the future projection here. Nice 63% earnings per share growth and 15% revenue growth. I, I would uh, go with that one also. So with that, um, I will keep it short this time. Thank you very much. Happy investing and trading. Please subscribe.